Hello, this is Professor Grant Thrall speaking to you. Welcome to my classes. Uh, I would like to take the opportunity to give uh, a big overview of the uh, establishing uh, an internet chat room for the students in my courses. Uh, you must be enrolled in the course to participate in the chat room. The purpose of the chat room is for you all to interact with each other. I will not be participating in the forum, but I will be reading the forum. I request that you keep on the topic of the course. If you choose to discuss materials not on the topic of the course, then there are a lot of forums to do that. You can make certainly make arrangements to uh, uh, communicate uh, offline or in another forum on other topics. Uh, but please keep the uh, topics in our forum to the topics of the course uh, and try to uh, uh, create a uh, make an effort to create a, uh, a positive interactive environment. If I see flaming, if I see any uh, type of uh, behavior that can be uh, construed as being harassment or bullying, uh, I'll just shut the person off from the forum and uh, without warning uh, they'll just be cut off. Uh, the, uh, if you uh, see web sites, uh, videos, other materials that you believe is better than what you're seeing on our web pages for our courses, then please let me know and I will review them. And if these are uh, pages, uh, videos that I can access, uh, for our course, then I will consider uh, changing or adding uh, that material uh, to our course. Uh, send me an email uh, if you want to discuss the, uh, any of the materials uh, in the class. Uh, put in the subject line the number and name of the class so that it does not go to my uh, junk mailbox. I get a lot of email. so. Make sure that the subject has uh, the course name and the course number in it and in the body of the email that it has your name, your full name, your first name, your last name, your email address uh, and a telephone number and your student ID. Uh, and that way I can uh, communicate with you uh, most effectively. Please keep your questions very specific uh, and so that I can respond to them. It's very difficult for me to respond to a question like, uh, I'm totally lost in the course and I've been so since the first day. Uh, what am I to do? What am I to say to that? Uh, my best recommendation in that context is to, one, go over the material that you have on the internet. Uh, you can play and replay the videos, you can read and reread uh, the uh, written materials that you'll be accessing uh, by way of the, uh, uh, of the uh, internet or if I have an assigned textbook. Uh, so I could say just go back to stage one and go over the materials or drop the class. That's, a, that's about all I can say. Now if you have a very specific question, it's something that I can respond to. I can provide an answer to, I would like to provide an answer to, and it may well be a question that other students have also, they just haven't asked me yet. So if you have a question, ask me a specific question and I will direct my response to all of the students in an appropriate manner, perhaps by way of an email broadcast uh, or perhaps by way of uh, adding a, uh, a new uh, video. Uh, the uh, uh, assignments are going to have a, a deadline. Each assignment has a, a closing date. You can submit your assignment at any time up to that closing date, after which the assignments won't be accepted. Uh, the purpose of the assignments are to, for you to self-test yourself. And second is, is so that we continue along uh, with the material. We have a body of material that the university expects that I will go through. We will go through that material and this 
uh, keeps us at a, at a reasonable t pace. Uh, the worst way to learn is to try to cram the night before an exam. Uh, if you just keep up with it, uh, you'll find that you'll be a master of the subject. And the purpose of being a master of the subject uh, is in part so that when you leave the university, uh, this information will be with you, will be part of your body of knowledge, uh, which will then enhance whatever it is that comes next after you leave the university. Uh, have a good time. Uh, I hope to provide a positive learning environment. I welcome your feedback. Enjoy the semester.